Hi everyone. I look for a lot of the different secrets and mysteries from all around the world, looking for the coming of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, Emmanuel, the Son of God, who was risen from the dead and took all the sins of the world away. Now the world elite, the Illuminati, the Freemasons, and even the spiritual realms that are all around us, they leave their signs and secrets right in front of us, in symbolism. And on our channel, we bring all this back to the Word of God and show how we're nearing the end of days. Well, we just had the State of the Union speech with Donald Trump here, talking about how the presidency is going, and there was a lot of symbolism between him and Nancy Pelosi and the women there. Especially all the women showed up dressed in white, the Democratic women. See how they're all sitting together in white? These are all signs of the biblical end times coming. We are in the time of the beast now. A beast with seven heads and ten horns. A great red dragon speaking great things. A great red dragon having seven heads and ten horns going after a woman in white. The dragon stood before the woman, which was ready to be delivered, for to devour her child as soon as it was born. And she brought forth a man-child who was to rule all nations with a rod of iron, and her child was caught up to God and to his throne. This means that we are nearing the time of Jesus Christ, and the wedding of the Lamb, and for Jesus to go to the throne, and to defeat the great red dragon, speaking great things. See there? Just like President Trump talks of make America great again. Obama was part of this also with the seven heads and ten horns. So ten horns. These are mapped out. See the woman in white ready? There's Trump. There's the women. All in white. Is anybody getting the connection yet, especially on my channel, all of the Christians? It's 2019. Revelation 19. The marriage of the Lamb. Let us be glad and rejoice and give honor to him, for the marriage of the Lamb has come, and his wife hath made herself ready. And to her was granted that she should be arrayed in fine linen, clean and white. For the fine linen is the righteousness of saints. And then Jesus rides the white horse to defeat the beast and the false prophet. 19. The women have made themselves white. And the great red dragon is on the seat of the throne of the world. See it all right there? See how all the women are dressed in white? And watch Donald Trump attack them. Donald Trump Jr. shared a meme about women. It backfired spectacularly. See the dragon and his brethren attacking the women in white. Doesn't matter what you might think about Nancy Pelosi and these things. The women have made themselves ready to be delivered. It's 2019. Does that mean it's going to happen now? We don't know. But that's what the symbolism is. This is Trump Tower on 5th Avenue, and it shows the beast fighting the woman. There is Trump Tower, and do you see how it looks like a, like a shark fin? One of the ten horns. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven heads and ten horns, and they will stand before the sun. The sun trying to stop them from getting into heaven. And now, you see Donald Trump's right there. And now you can see the big beast, just like the elephant for the Republicans. There it is. This is the sword for Jesus Christ. And this is the rapture for the women. See the eagle? That's the rapture for all of them. For Revelation 12. This is why Donald Trump just does so much tweeting. It's compared to a flood and the serpent.
cast out of his mouth water as a flood after the woman. There is a flood coming out of their mouth after the woman. That he might cause her to be carried away of the flood. And to the woman were given two wings of a great eagle that she might fly into the wilderness. And now Donald Trump and the world leaders that all work for Satan will attack the women. And the dragon was wroth with the woman and went to make war with the remnant of her seed. There they are making war, tweeting and going against them. That's war. So there's all the women. Dressed in white, they're ready to be delivered. Everybody's ready. Not this guy. Not that guy. They're all trying to hold on for as much time as they can on this earth. This encompasses most world rulers. The China, Vladimir Putin's, your Saudi Arabian prince that just murdered a reporter of the USA and nobody did anything about it. It's going on and on. But there's the women dressed in white, fighting the dragon. There they all are. That is Revelation 19. It was shown on a world stage that the women have made themselves ready. And his wife hath made herself ready. And to her was granted that she should be arrayed in fine linen, clean and white. For the fine linen is the righteousness of saints. The rider on the white horse, the defeat of the beast and the false prophet that brings lies. And you can see here, they're attacking all the women in white. It's going right by the scripture. And then verified, there is Donald Trump as one of the ten horns that is granted one hour with the beast. And that represents Jesus getting ready to take the throne and to begin the eternal kingdom of God. Hallelujah. Confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart God hath risen him from the dead and you'll be saved. Hallelujah. The wife, all of us, hath made themselves ready. She is ready to be delivered. And pained to be delivered. See there? All this pain going on. all the pain everywhere to be delivered everybody's ready confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus believe in your heart God hath risen him from the dead and you'll be saved hallelujah the woman fighting the great red dragon hallelujah